there's only so much that you can learn in a textbook, you have to see it. I would say that you're challenged here when you're in nursing school. If you're not challenged beforehand, it's going to be quite a shock when you get there. I feel like UNCG did a good job of instilling how important it was to care about what you're doing. When I got here, it felt like home. My coaches took the time to know Aja before she was a basketball player number 14 on the court. There was just so many limitless opportunities I felt like here at UNCG. Beyond just being a genetic counselor who counsels patients in the clinic, I do want to have a greater impact on the surrounding community just by sharing the education that I've learned. The overarching goal of my research agenda with my team is to repay the education debt. A lot of the youth that we work with have not had good experiences in formal school science. We do a lot of hands-on, we do a lot of what did you observe, trying to see with new eyes that they are doing science in their everyday lives. You don't know that you're doing it, but it's really there. Helping people is just something that's always felt exciting for me. My mom inspired me to pursue a position in the medical field. It's just an amazing opportunity to receive a full-ride scholarship. It's like an open door. UNCG is home. I live in Greensboro. The joy I get from the scholarship is immediate. I see the impact it has. Find something that you love. Find something that gives you joy and focus your gifts on that. Having research funds available, it does encourage students to step out of their comfort zone and take on projects and reach populations that they may not think that they would have been able to reach without it. My project specifically focus on creating a educational video for families who might be at risk for certain cancer syndromes. I had the opportunity here to create a model for other providers. Historically, the field of education has thought about scale in terms of numbers. Can you reduce your program to a thing Right, a curriculum that we can then disseminate. We've been thinking about generational skill. If we invest in a group of young people now, it helps them to see that school is somewhere where I can start to have a voice and have agency. I don't have to be consigned to the sidelines. The scholarship that I received gave me peace of mind. I didn't have this horrible weight on my shoulders at all times. I worked in the ICU for three years, getting to see people getting out and being excited that they're leaving and knowing that you had a part to play in that. As a child, I did not have an educator who looked like me in STEM, much less a group of youth who look like me in STEM. More than STEM opportunities for youth, you were also funding these positive relationships. I am passionate about coaching women's basketball. Being able to mentor young women, the way I was mentored here at UNCG, I'm the most confident I feel when I'm playing basketball. When I'm out in that court, I feel more of a powerful voice. The athletics program has grown me up. I feel like I'm walking out of here fearless. These are the moments in which kids are becoming doers of science and engineering, and they start to see that there is science and engineering inherently already in me, inherently already in my community and for donors to see that they are directly responsible for creating that moment of joy. It gives me a tremendous sense of pride to give back to a program that has meant so much to me. Give the gifts you have in mind, let it grow, because the world needs it.